Look at this shit. Corey went crazy. Look in Tony Stark's house. Rucker, how's, how's your regular coffee? Holy shit, Corey, I was about to do the exact same thing. <laughs> I was setting this up, I was gonna give you the mic. <laughs> Mm. Yeah, you, Metcalf and I, we went with the, the nice fancy Americano. Rucker, he's got, he's got this little house coffee thing. After the No Ceilings crew got our caffeine fix, we headed over to the Blazers practice facility for the practice sessions. First up was Team World. A bunch of really impressive guys on that side that bled right into the Team US practice. And we noticed a stark difference on both teams right away compared to last year. Dylan Harper was super physical on both sides of the ball. Guys were going at it in the 1v1 drills, full court, bringing the intensity. Here we see Isaiah Evans and Trey Johnson going at it. Slim, all up in his shit. Gets a really good contest, forcing the tough miss. And then lastly, we finish it off with just an aerial show from Ace Bailey. The next day, we went to the Nike Hoop Summit scrimmages. The Portland Generals had two scrimmages against the U.S. and the world team back-to-back, -back, but they put up a really good fight in the first game against the U.S. It was tight most of the game. Watch out for Junie Mobley at Ohio State next year. Kids got a stroke like Steph. Uh, I even got to interview some of the guys, and my microphone didn't work, which was really cool. Technology rocks. What are we doing, boys? Today, we're eating donuts and... Good fuel, fueling up for uh, what day three? Day three. Day three of hoops on it. We got practices today. Um, Vlog boys gotta go to work. Gotta get, gotta get on the uh, pod. That's true. It's been about three hours since we uh, started because we wanted to pod, but here we are. The haters told us that it wasn't possible. And honestly, I'm impressed. They're, they were right. Three, three hours in, looks like they fucking nailed it on the head. Well done. Shout out to the haters. We're not giving up. Mm -hmm. Corey, tell us more. Sometimes in this process, mm -hmm. also, this, I'm not talking into this microphone. Exactly. No, this is the issue. <laughs> you have to go through adversity. Mm. But the real lotto level talents fight through that adversity. Hell yeah. show up when it matters right what a week of basketball we got yeah. hoop summit all week now we're we're heading to the blazers game gonna see the rockets i'm in thompson a little cam whitmore maybe a little, a little full circle uh you know 20 23 shout out to the sun right there cutting off my face but 23 draft to the 24 draft to the 25 draft. vlogs are chaotic Vlog. Vlogs are chaotic. Oh yeah, well, maybe Dylan Brooks. We'll see. We'll see if they're playing any of their vets. Scoot's playing. We're excited for that. He's had some moments lately. Basketball, guys. What are we doing, guys? What's the what's the game plan? Game plan is to Dr. Jack sit down, talk about Delano Banton, DB Hooper, talk about Duop Reed, and um, thank God Jalen Green didn't get hurt seriously. That was scary. 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 Where are we at? We're at Dr. Jack. Uh, done wine from Blazers, Rockets, basketball, NBA. Scoot looked fantastic. Woo! I thought a men looked pretty good. Jalen Green scared the hell out of us. A men was filling it up. A men was, a men was filling it up. With 14 rebounds. Unbelievable. Albert, what did Cam Whitmore say in the huddle? Uh, Cam Whitmore bricked a three, came back to the bench, and was like, I'm ass. <laughs> um, and his coach responded by saying, yeah. Your ass. <laughs> it was fantastic. Final breakfast. Rucker. <laughs> no. He hasn't had his coffee yet, so he gets a little grumpy in the morning, but we're about to fix that. He told us we're all up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're not enough, buddy. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Tommy John's not available. <laughs> Um, I just. How was, uh, how's everyone's time in Portland? Pretty outstanding, man. Pretty, okay. uh, pretty fantastic. Did you, did you see Schmitz last night? Yeah. Yeah. By the way, we're 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 just vlogging for like a few minutes, so. <laughs> we're on the phone with Draft Deeper. He's. you're in this kind of setting working with you know different teammates different coaches different setting than you're used to every day what was your kind of biggest takeaway from this week that you're going to kind of take away with you going into the future uh for me just the level of competition is always competing no matter what i think any setting i'm in that we're in and that the rest of my teammates are in i think we're going to compete at a high level and i think that's really what i think set us apart from them the world team that we just really compete in is one and more yeah i think um back and what you said just um, kind of building on from the start of the week, just the competitiveness, really. Um, we had a really special group of guys, uh, really talented. I think a lot of guys kind of sacrificed some, some stuff tonight um, and just, just playing a role. Um, and you don't see that all the time, uh, like with all these games, when you put all these players together. But I think we really just had a lot of guys just sacrifice some stuff and just play a role tonight. So we dropped Rucker off and we decided to have the best day ever and go get ice cream. <laughs> I went cookies and cream. Albert, you did a, a half scoop situation. Yeah, I did um, half Oregon strawberry and half Spumoni. Stay true to the state, I like that. Um, Metcalf, what'd you go with? Just classic cookie dough. Classic Keep cookie. it simple. He, not broke, don't fix it. Big mistake not getting a waffle cone, but you know. This weekend's been full of mistakes, but we just want to, uh, you know, sign off of, of this blog, wishing, uh, you know, our good friend Tyler Rucker the happiness that we've gotten to experience eating this amazing ice cream from from the Lake Oswego Creamery. This is No Ceiling signing off.